The lethal Lothario is here. The high-risk heartbreaker, Angel. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Los Lotharios from Monterey, Mexico. Weighing in at 205 pounds, Angel! A third generation superstar, a former cruiserweight champion, and the biggest heartbreaker since HBK. Yeah, a truly lethal Lothario. Best believe this angel is going to fly. That was really good, Saxton. Deep thoughts there. WWE Universe, let him talk to you. Of the LA Knight may let his fits do the talking tonight. And his opponent from Hagerstown, Maryland, weighing in at 230 pounds. himself the megastar. Well, he won't be one of those in the fashion world, but LA Knight might be able to earn that moniker in the ring. Decades of experience. He's held top titles all throughout the world, so he is more than ready for the stage of WWE. You have to appreciate the unapologetic charm and brazen self confidence of LA Knight. This guy believes he's a certified megastar and acts accordingly. It's certainly something in the way Knight struts around. You love him or hate him. You can't deny he's got the build, the skills, and the look of a superstar. I'm sure Knight is planning to win this match in the same stylish manner that he does everything else. And on the other end is Angel, who I think a lot of people expect big things from. And rightfully so. Angel is sports entertainment royalty, a multiple-time champion, and frankly, he's a fountain of charisma. It's not often you get a superstar with this kind of raw potential. Right to the kidneys from behind. Down with a sling blade. And a basement drop kick. Send him up here. Up in the suplex. Oh, no. Breaker. LA Knight all attitude tonight, but how does he convert confidence into results? Knight has thoroughbred athleticism. His in-ring knowledge is almost surgical. So as long as he keeps his cool, there's a very strong chance he earns the win tonight. And he's able to fight Angel off. Boom, what a punch! Angel didn't exactly come up big against that one. Knight looking like a certified megastar going on the offensive. Carefully placed stop to the arm. What are we about to see? Oh, knee right to the hands. Who won the race? Charlie's horse. Now, that'll do some serious damage. You expect these pins to last much longer. Into the cover! Kicks out after one. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match? He switches it back around. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Things have really broken down in this rivalry. I don't even know if there's even any rhyme or reason anymore. These superstars just want to destroy each other. Yeah, and while that's a fine motivation for a horror movie villain, all logic is seemingly...
seemingly flown out the window in this rivalry. All that's driving them is emotion. The emotion to destroy each other. For the win! Two! Establishes him to the world. An important win for him in this one. With a win like that, he just stood up and commanded the attention of everyone in the WWE Universe. I think they've noticed, Byron. 